Hello Aries, I hope you're all doing well. In today's reading, we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about for January. Um, not only do we have the Neptune fog with the hanged man and do you see the clouds in the background? We have Seven of Cups, which can definitely indicate confusion, especially with a uh, disappearance here. Um, I'm not sure, you know, if you've ghosted this person because how they think you're feeling about them, we have Four of Cups and Lovers in Reverse. So they feel that you are no longer interested, you've rejected them, and there's been a fallout, and you're moving forward with your life. So whether that's true or not, I'm not sure. We'll dig here deeper, but they feel you're not interested in them. So they seem to be very confused. Let's clarify. Why is Hangman here? Some of you, there may have been distance because we do have flight plan. Why is Hangman here for the person on Aries' mind? Yeah, they're on, you're on a break here. No communication. They... There is a lot of uh, passion here. Some of you, this may have started off as a fling for some of you. And there is emotions here, right? We do have Pisces and Venus, Venus and Scorpio. And as I say Scorpio, we have Scorpio come through again. But yeah, it's almost the universe um, taking a step in, uh, you know, putting brakes on things for this person. Um, they're finding it extremely frustrating because the person you're dealing with is coming through as the king of wands in reverse can be a sagittarius usually king of wands does not like restrictions right they need their freedom their space to move around and if we look at the hanged man this is very frustrating this person seems to be trapped um within their own mind their home whatever um but they're they're to pause and reflect King of Wands in reverse. <laughs> yeah, this person's extremely frustrated. Why is Seven of Cups here? They're not learning some lesson here with five. Round and round. They keep repeating the same cycle over and over again. And until they learn that lesson, they, they'll be stuck. We have Two of Cups, Temperance. So in regards to their stance um, when it comes to you, there's some differences here. Some of you, this is a bit of an opposite subtract. We do have fire and water, and they're coming through as more of the water energy. I mean, they were coming through as the king of wands, but you are a fire sign, so it's fire and water, right? So there is that emotional, intuitive bond. They feel it. Some of them may not even be able to explain um, why they feel the way they do about you, right? But there is emotion here. This person's lack of direction, uh, making a decision is what I think led to the situation falling apart. Because what they want from you, we have nine of pentacles, two of wands, the chariot. This person is, for one, they're clinging to their independence. They're very defensive and they have a hard time making up their mind, which is why we had scatteredness, right? And on Chariot, we have this way or that way, them being pulled in two different directions. So they don't even know what they want from you, Aries, which is why they can't give you any clarity. They need to gain that clarity for themselves. With the hangman, they've been reflecting, but they I don't see them coming to any sort of conclusion or making that decision right, which is keeping things at a halt here. That is if you even want them. Um, because for how they're perceiving you, Three of Swords, Magician in Reverse. There may have been issues in the way you communicated with each other because we have Swords and Mercury come through, right? Differing viewpoints that opposites attract, right? Not on the same page, but they're viewing you as someone they're in separation with and you're not communicating, you're not initiating anything. Yeah, Queen of Swords. You put up boundaries. Some of you, this is a 50-50. Some of you have blocked communication um, here. They have no means of reaching you. And others of you may be open to hear them out with the sword raised. I don't think you're going out of your way to approach them, but you'd be open to hear them out if they were to 
send you a message. Why is Magician in reverse here for how this person is viewing Aries? Why is Magician in reverse here? You're mirroring one another here. High Priestess, Five of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. This person, if there's no uh, communication, they're confused. Um, they feel that, you know, some days they assume that, you know, you're not putting in the work, so you don't want them. You're not interested. And a little part of them says, oh, no, they still miss me. Right. So there is that confusion. They don't quite, they don't really know where they stand with you. Why is the magician in reverse? Let's get one more on this energy. Yeah, you're not moving forward, Knight of Pentacles, because of the disagreements here. Some of you conflict within a commitment or family or interference from other people. Gossip that also caused um, some arguments between the both of you, right? How this person will be feeling about you, Devil in reverse, High Priestess upright. They felt something was toxic about the situation. And if there was a lot of disagreements, for example, if it was a third party, right? They have a family. King of Wands can be someone with a bit of a wandering eye, right? They feel the best thing, the right thing to do in this situation would be to uh, take a step back. Why is Devil in reverse here? Or how this person will be feeling? Hangman, yeah, they're choosing to stay, take a step back. They're choosing to or they're being forced to, right? We have a lot of major arcana here. Why is High Priestess coming through? Things are on, you're on a break from one another. Four of Swords, Hangman, right? It's, things are at a, it's pause. The divine timing is also coming through. Why is High Priestess here? Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they're holding back. Some of you were dealing with a player who's very secretive. They may have been in and out, very confused, and as a result, causing you a lot of headaches here. <laughs> Same cards in two different decks. Queen of Cups, Justice in Reverse. And this exact combination came through in your feelings. Some of you may have worked with this person. Some reference to work is coming through here. They're mirroring you. You're not giving them much to work with. And you have a reason for it. You know, your reason was that um, things were in imbalance. You felt the situation threw you off balance. And I think it threw them off balance as well, right? There's a lot of chaos here in their overall stance. So I think it threw both of you off here. Um, and something about this situation seemed unfair or one-sided. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Either it was this person scattering their energy, giving to more than one, or it was just breadcrumbing, right? Giving here and there, holding back. What action they'll be taking towards you? We have King of Swords, Six of Swords in reverse. This is interesting. Let's clarify. Why is King of Swords in reverse here? For what action this person will be taking? This is not over, Aries. Some of you are dealing with an error sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Yeah, they're not they're not they're not planning on taking any action towards you. Again, reference to travel or distance. Very rigid, stubborn energy. Some of you, this person has family and children. And they were at a distance. Definite player vibes I'm getting from this individual. But yeah, actions, they're not taking action towards you. They're not communicating. They're holding back. Why is Six of Swords in reverse here?
wow same energy king of swords in reverse yeah what they're hiding from you is that if they're in another commitment there's a lot of arguments uh conflict within that situation but they lo do look back at what happened between the both of you so although they're not initiating or communicating they do miss you five of cups there's missing longing they feel like they're doing what's best for them, but a part of them still yearns for you. Their intentions, Queen of Swords, Five of Pentacles. Why is Queen of Swords in reverse for this person's intentions? World in reverse, yeah. They feel it's not over, but it's also not the right time here. Why is Five of Pentacles here? For this person's intentions. Yeah, wasn't I saying it's not the right time? We have star in reverse, wheel of fortune, ten of swords. They're sort of letting um, things end here, right? They're not going out of their way to make anything happen. There's a little bit of a loneliness or pessimism when it comes to the situation. But there's, we have a lot of major arcana come through. There's external forces getting in the way. Um, they may be going through some difficulties, can be family or finances here. That has nothing to do with you, which is also, also proving to be an obstacle. And those of you, there's distance, right? That can also be that external factor here. Why is Five of Pentacles coming through? High Priestess, Six of Cups. Some of you, this was a hidden connection, a hidden affair. Or just someone keeping their emotions to themselves, not expressing, not being vulnerable. Definitely get it, get it from this person's energy. Your feelings, Aries, Queen of Cups, Justice in Reverse. You're feeling drained, right? Wow. Why is Queen of Cups in Reverse here for how Aries will be feeling? Yeah, you both feel the same way. They're also missing you. You feel sadness. There's a longing. Because there's separation with the Three of Swords. Why is justice in reverse? Some of you, this could have been a divorce or you may have been committed to this person. And there were some challenges. Three, look at that. Three of swords, three of wands. Third element interfering, causing the situation to fall apart. It's not what it's telling me with justice in reverse. Perhaps you need to take a step back and assess the situation, right? Because I'm seeing it's not um, quite built on a solid foundation to begin with, especially if there is a third energy here. Why is justice in reverse here for how Aries will be feeling? Let's get you one more. Yeah, tower, exactly. Tower in reverse, chariot in reverse, nine of swords. The situation is not built on a solid foundation. And as a result, um, there is some avoidance here. Things aren't moving forward. This person has a decision to make. They're refusing to make that decision because they don't have that clarity themselves, right? To pick a direction. And as a result, it's causing you, or it did cause you a lot of, Stress, sleepless nights, right? Not knowing where you stood. Your outcome, strength in reverse, the world upright, two of cups in reverse, temperance, ten of pentacles, uh, ten of swords, king of wands in reverse. Um, definitely, if this person has family, children, um, that will be their focus. So if they are committed to you, um, that is where their focus will be on this commitment, this marriage, right? And reconciling any differences with temperance. But don't settle for last year is the message with two of cups in reverse, right? This isn't over. There is patience needed, divine timing at play. But for the time being, I do see someone uh, giving up, releasing control and letting go, right? It's the completion of a cycle. You've learned whatever you've needed to learn. The lesson one was learning here was... Uh, letting go of control issues, right? 
divine timing, which is why we had hanged man here twice. Wheel of Fortune. But this energy is very erratic. Um, they're coming through as unstable and be someone with a wandering eye player. So you will have to be careful of this energy, especially if they have done you wrong in the past. So that is something you'll have to Too many. This love is so intense, I can't help but to wonder if you put a spell on me. There's nowhere to hide. <laughs> yeah, this person feels so weird of feeling enchanted by another with that Neptune energy, right? Looking, seeing someone with rose colored glasses, or just not being able to see the other clearly definitely get that energy with Neptune. I'm resisting my desire for you because it's too late now. I wasted too much time. Something to do with time here. Things not getting off the ground, bad timing. And this person may be, um, right, we have, I'm resisting my desire because I. it's too late now. So they may be afraid here as well. Fear is getting in the way. We have, I feel terrible for ghosting you and avoiding you. I didn't have the courage to say what needed to be said. Which is interesting because we had flight plan, a disappearance and lack of closure here. Hmm. <laughs> I had a change of heart. I'm going to follow my intuition. I really miss you. I see you in everything. You're always with me. This person went in a different direction and then now they have a change of heart. They miss you. That is what is coming through. There's a yearning. I fear you're going to find someone better if I don't get it together soon. This person is aware, right? If they don't make that decision, they will lose you. You'll move on. What is this person's intentions? Oh, they're jealous. This jealousy is making me want to rush in. Don't be surprised if I get a little too overprotective. I want you to myself. King of Wands in reverse. Very possessive energy. What is this person on Aries' mind intentions? Oh, okay. Despite what's happening between us, I still believe we can make a great couple in the future. So they haven't lost hope when it comes to the situation. get you one more Aries. What is this person's intentions? Can you learn to trust me? I'm going to be honest with you. You're important to me. Yeah, this person will be communicating. I'm not sure it's around the corner, but keep in mind it's a general reading. I'm willing to start a fight just to have a chance to talk to you. Just say something to me. Yeah, they want communication. I've lost my patience. It's time that I move on. Yeah. They will. I think there will be a period where they're sort of surrendering, going with the flow, not trying to control anything. And then, right, it's the fears creep in. They're jealous. And they want to know what you're up to and they'll want to rush back uh, towards you. Because if we look at the King of Wands, he's looking at your spread rather than looking away from it, right? So definitely. I want one more, actually. What is this person's intentions towards Aries? I'm moving on, there's no fixing us. Well, wow, something about time, I feel like I need to read this. Finally, the perfect time to come together. Our love will prove to be worth the wait. Yeah, that divine timing. Please take my call, let's forget the past and start over. Waiting for that right opportunity to approach. We have, I'm ending my current relationship to be with you. I'm not sure about this one here. Um, if that's the, the, that third energy I was picking up on, right? But it's not the most trustworthy energy, regardless of what they're saying, because they are King of Wands in reverse, and they are um, very confused, right? So this can be someone who sort of runs hot and cold, um, giving mixed signals, um, feeling confused, lacking direction. What advice do you? What advice do you have? <laughs> have a drink. 
something is lurking and it doesn't look good remember there are blessings in life that are disguised in difficulties let let it make you better yeah you're learning you're growing right i said with the world you've learned your lesson here but with something is lurking and it doesn't look good I want more. Wow, yeah, learn the lesson. Learn the lesson from your breakup, even though it may seem darn near impossible to find silver lining. Give yourself time and dig deep. Yeah, wild abandon. This can sometimes be sort of a friends with benefits card for me. Um, someone sort of just jumping off the cliff, acting foolish, right? Um, without care. Careless. That is the word. Not appreciating the other for when they're around, right? But there's... Let me get you one more. Oh, intimacy, exactly. I think at one point you did give this person your heart with giving oneself, right? But they broke your heart. They're seeing you as three of swords. You don't trust with the queen of swords now. Some of you, it can be because of past betrayals hurts, but it can be definitely because of this person. Right? With the Queen of Cups, the Queen of Cups was once upright. So you were offering this person a lot of emotional support, unconditional love, right? You weren't even expecting much from them, but... They just feel, Aries, they feel like a lost soul. And they are player, they have player-like tendencies, right? Sort of just wanting to have a good time. Not wanting to be tied down to anything with the Nine of Pentacles. There may even be a fear of um, being tied down or committed, which is interesting. They're most likely having a very difficult time with this hangman energy. <laughs> Do you see how restricted he is? The hands are tied, the feet are tied, and that's, you know, the King of Wands. A lot more, more so passion and lust coming through, right? In their energy. Whereas you are coming through as more emotional here. 